the hang of positioning this camera and the music volumes where they should be, but maybe I'll learn one day. Maybe not. Split malt liquor, OML, 32 ounce, 32 ounce Thursday, two 32 ounce Thursdays in a row ladies and gentlemen. I don't know what's gotten into me, maybe I should just move to Florida. Just kidding, I'd probably kill myself, I really hate the heat. I really, really do not like heat. <coughs> this isn't bad. Not a huge fan of OML, to be honest, most of the time. I drink a 40 every once in a while when I find them fresh, which is like, never. Most of the places I find this, they're two, three years old. I have one store that even has old labels. Like, not like brick labels, but the one that wasn't all shiny from like 2009. I don't know. I like these core bottles though. It's kind of a change of pace. Fucking. I wish I had. Dude, Bull Ice in the court would be really awesome. I know they existed at one point, and if they still do, I don't know. Red Bull in the court would also be. I think courts are just kind of cool, just because I can't really get them. in the spot though definitely found in uh, Baltimore along with that Country Club 32 that I drank last week OG malt liquor. I don't think that's true. Pretty sure Country Club's actually the first malt liquor. Although don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure that's that's accurate. And this is in fact a fresh one. September 15th of this year. Barely fresh, but it is fresh nonetheless. <coughs> That's my own fault though, I always fucking get this shit. And I either forget about it or I have other shit that I want to drink. And I, you know, I go to be like, oh, I have that. And I'm like, oh, now it's expired. When I got it, it was like three months in date. <coughs> yeah, I don't know, I'm weird. I have been drinking a lot of 11-11 lately because I have. I don't even. I don't even know. I think I have just just over a case left. Maybe a case and a half. And they they're not tasting too hot anymore. I mean they're definitely over a year expired at this point. So I've just been drinking a lot of those because if I keep letting them sit, they're just gonna get worse. And I mean. I don't mind sending them to people either, really. I've sent out a few, so... I mean... Like I said, at this point, it's really not even... It's not even really good. I've been on a really big Red Hot Chili Peppers kick lately. Red Hot Chili Peppers have always been one of my favorite bands since I was like, probably 
Well, I don't know. Whenever I first started listening to music, they were always like one of my favorite bands. And I'm like everyone else. I, uh, I don't know. Like, because I was like a little kid when, like, Californication, by the way, was coming out. I mean, like, but I didn't really know any of that because I went to private school and I couldn't listen to the radio. But my dad had this CD, and it was What Hits, and it was all their shit from when they were, like, on EMI, which is, like, their actual, like, funk shit from, like, the 80s. And that's, like, he gave me that CD, and that's what I always was into, was the shit from the 80s. And, I mean, the new stuff's also really fucking good. I mean, by the way, and everything after that, it's not, not good, but... <sighs> Definitely one of the most solid bands in my opinion. At one point I had a Red Hot Chili Peppers tattoo right here. It was really small and I gave it to myself with a sewing needle. And it was really shitty so I got it covered up. But, you can still kind of see it if you look hard enough. I do want to get one done better though at some point but I don't think I'm gonna get the, the asterisk star thing I wanna get like this it's like from the cover of their very first album from 84 it's like this like graffiti dude and he's like holding a microphone that was actually my tag that I did when I used to tag you know never actually did that shit you know I thought it was cool though but yeah I don't know it's like this dude like holding a microphone and his tongue is like out. I don't know. I think it'd be a cool tattoo. <sighs> OML though. decent stuff. It's not my favorite, but it's, it's far from horrible, and it's definitely better than Country Club. <sighs> Is there swill when it comes to quartz? I'm not really sure, though. The quota on that, but... I intended this to be like a five minute video. I think I started rambling a little bit, but whatever. <coughs> Malt liquor. Leave her alone. 